you know who I am? The card is fine. It must be your stupid machine. Try it again. God, people are so stupid. Good morning. Hold on, hold on. We at the Soho house, okay? So yes, you heard it correct. We are staying at the Soho house this week in Los Angeles. This is my first week back in LA since I left about a year and a half ago. And I'm excited to be back. I'm gonna meet up with a few friends. I'm actually about to head to West Hollywood to meet up with my friend Amber. Let me show you guys the fit real quick. It's actually kind of cold in LA, which I'm upset about because it's cold in New York and I was hoping it was gonna be warm. It's sunny, but it's not that warm. Anyways, I'm wearing the vintage Juicy Velour sweater and these pants, hold on. I have to unbuckle them when I'm sitting because I'm too fat. I'm not fat, but like they're just too tight in the waist. So this is my outfit. Hold on, there's the boots. I'm kind of getting like Avril Lavigne vibes today with this fit. I don't know how I feel about the pants cause they give me like pajama bottom feel, but then I also like them because plaid is cool. backstory on this bathing suit I actually made it a few years back because I was trying to start a clothing line and this was one of my pieces um, anyways then I got nervous that nobody was gonna like my designs so I didn't actually put anything out and I didn't sell anything but now I'm looking at it like okay it's kind of cute you know it was kind of ahead of its time um, so I'm rocking it Good morning, it's day two of my trip here in LA. It's about 6.30 right now, but I'm feeling about 9.30 because I'm on New York time and I was thinking about going downstairs to hit up the gym. I actually didn't bring any really gym clothes or shoes. Those are the only boots that I brought, my big chunky combat boots. So I'm just gonna wear those to the gym and then maybe take them off and just like work out on a mat with my socks on. Um, but I just don't wanna go four days without doing any workouts. Just got back from the gym. I'm gonna shower up and then go upstairs for breakfast. I just wanted to show you guys a few things. So apparently Soho House has their own skincare line, which I thought was really cool, but that's not all. Let me show you guys this crazy array of shampoos and shower gels that they give you in the bathroom. Um, I mean, this is just amazing. Like, can I take this home? Do you think they're gonna charge me for that? I'm about to head to the fashion district and just like explore downtown LA for a little bit, but this is the look of the day. This is actually a squirt. These are shorts and then this little flap goes over it. Um, and my combat boots, these are the only shoes I brought on this trip. So pretty much just pairing them with everything at this point. The one thing I miss about LA is all the smoothie spots they have. I just went to Juice Crafters and I got the Chunky Monkey. Oh, it's my favorite. I was craving it so bad. So I woke up at 5.30 today, that was fun. Um, this lounge didn't open up till eight, so I was like, oh my God, what am I gonna do till eight? But I just um, started editing one of my YouTube videos and I'm finally here, I'm at the lounge, it's open, it's really cute, it's empty because it's early. I'm about to go get my hair cut, I'm excited. It's super oily right now because I know she's gonna wash it, so I'm just gonna like wait until she handles that for me, but yeah, I feel dirty, even though I'm not. And this is my outfit of the day. I'm wearing a Maje romper and I didn't have any pockets or a purse so I attached my keys to my shoestring. I did the deed, I cut the locks. I think it looks super cute. She did a great job. 
And now I'm in Beverly Hills, about to catch some sushi with my friend Miho. So I am freaking out right now. I was just upstairs at the pool and guess who I ran into? I ran into Cootie from the Kanye West documentary. Oh my gosh, I didn't even recognize him until I heard somebody call him and they were like, Cootie. And I looked over and I was like, wait, that's Cootie. And he came up to me and he complimented me on my tooth gems. So anyways, he ended up leaving shortly after, but his friend stayed and his friend started talking to me and he was like, yeah, you know, that's Cootie from the Kanye West documentary. And I was like, that was Cootie, wasn't it? <laughs> and anyways, yeah, so we were talking and he was like, yeah, you know, like, what do you do? And I told him, I was like, oh yeah, you know, I do music. I could use a music video. So he was like, yeah, totally. Like Cootie lives in New York. I was like, I live in New York. So he was like, oh, totally. Like, I'm gonna link you guys. I'm gonna, he was like calling some engineers for me. He was like, oh yeah, I'll get you in the studio, like blah, blah, blah. And I was like, oh my God, I would love to be on Kanye's album. Thank you. <laughs> Anyways, um, crazy. It's so crazy who you can run into. It's a very sad morning because I'm leaving and I don't wanna leave, I wanna stay.